Okay guys, so today I'm going to show you how you can create and insert an embed code on your website. And for this, we're going to consider a few different scenarios. All right, so let's get started. Very good, so first, what is an embed code and what is it used for? Well, it's very simple actually. An embed code is a block of code like this one here that is used to add external content to any HTML document or a short code like this one here that can be copied from one website to another. And this way, by using those codes, you can actually embed a chatbot, a blog or social media feeds, videos perhaps, maybe Google Maps, or any type of interactive web application. So let me show you a few different examples. Okay guys, so let's take a very popular example, how to embed a video. So let's take an example here, a YouTube video, but this would work also with Vimeo or any other platform, obviously, you know. So all you have to do is basically click on the video itself. And then from here, just underneath, as you can see, you have a share button. If you click on this, right there, you have embed. So click on that. And then this is the code, as you can see, this is an iframe and we have the width and the height. So you can customize this as well as you see fit. But first, let's copy that on our website. So we're going to copy this and now we're going to go to our website. And as an example here, we're going to use WordPress because this is one of the most popular platforms on the market at the moment. So let's pretend you want to insert this maybe on a page or a blog post. So let's do that together. So let's open a page as an example here. Let's create a new page. Let's give it a title. And now we can insert our block. So in this case, this is going to be a HTML code. Okay, so just search for HTML. There it is. Perfect. And now we can insert the code that we just copied from the YouTube website. So Control V, there it is. Now we can publish, publish, and let's have a quick preview. Okay, so view page. And there you go, guys, you can see our page has been created and we have indeed the video embedded into our page. Now you can also change the aspect of your video. So remember we had an iframe code, so this is basically an iframe, okay? So this is the code that we insert. And right here, as you can see, I have height and width. So you can change this as well. So let's say maybe instead of 560, we would have 1080, okay? And the width should then be 610 to have the same ratio. Now if we click update, and we go back to our home page and refresh. And there you go, as you can see, now the video is taking the full width of our page. And obviously you can change this accordingly depending on your own requirements. Very good, so now let's go back to our home page. And as you can see, we have a few different pages of home, services, about and contact. So let's go to the contact page and let me show you another type of embed. So obviously here, as you can see, you have the address, phone number and email. So maybe you want to help your visitors find your address easily. So how can you do so? And maybe we could insert a Google Maps right here underneath and obviously you can use Google Maps itself and add an embed code. So let me show you how this works. So this is the address here. So if you copy and paste this into Google Maps, it will give you this location here, okay? So this is basically a preview of our premises. So let's pretend we're here. And again, same principle. You need to share this information now, okay? So we click on the button here, share. And right here, you embed map. And again, as an embed, we have an iframe. And now we can copy the HTML code and insert this on our page. So let's do that together again. So we go back to our pages. We go to contact page. Let's scroll down the page. And again, we're going to insert a HTML code. So we search for HTML. And now we can insert the code we just copied from the Google Maps page. There it is. Okay. So update. And now let's have a quick look. So we go back to our contact page and refresh. And there you go, guys, as you can see now, the map is displaying right here underneath. And again, you can customize the width and the height accordingly as well. Maybe you want this to take the full width. Again, we can make those changes accordingly. So we go back to our page here and let's change the width. And we have 600 here, so I'm gonna change this to 1080, so 1080p, update. Let's go back here and refresh. And there you go, guys. You can see now this is taking up the full width of our contact page. And let me show you one last example here that's very popular. Let's say you wanted to share a Google Sheet. So let's pretend you want to share your monthly budget on your website. How can you do so? It's very simple. Again, you need to share this. So for this, we go to File, Share, and now we need to Publish to Web. Click on this. And as you can see right here, we have embed. I need to select if you want to embed the whole document or not. In our case, let's select the entire document and now we can publish and then confirm. There you go. So this is our course. So right click, copy. And again, let's go back to our website. So I've prepared this page already, monthly budget review and click on the plus sign, select HTML and paste it right here. Now we can publish, publish. 
let's have a quick look very good and as you can see it is displaying but we don't see the entirety of our spreadsheet so again you can customize this very easily all you have to do is go back to the editor here and change the content of our iframe so right here at the end you can add perhaps width 1080 height 1920 so this is full 1080p and frame border equals zero and then click update and let's have a quick look let's refresh and there you go guys as you can see now it's displaying in full and we can see the whole content of our spreadsheet so there you go guys these are a few different examples of how you can create and insert an embed code on your website now if your website's performances are lacking a bit and you'd like to improve the overall speed of your website in order to get more sales and generate more revenue, please feel free to visit our website, verpex.com, where you'll find a large selection of hosting plans suited to all kinds of businesses and industries. Now, as always, thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.